Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Poland Stronk. So we're beating up on France because France is a loser. And they decided that they were going to rival us over Calais. Which we've had for hundreds of years. So yeah, um... Basically we're just going to siege them down. We're at war with the United States, the Imperialist War. I don't remember why I did that. Was there a reason for declaring that war? What was the reason? I wanted my little colonial nation, little buddy, to expand, didn't I? Well, let's just, uh, oh, hey, look at that. United States, man, they are fighting back. So, you're on Tech 26. Little buddy's on Tech 27. I'm on Tech 28. So we got two tech levels on you. Are they significant tech levels? That's the real question. What do we get? Do we get any tactics at 26? No. And then we got some combat width. Ooh, and we got morale. Oh wait, he's on 26 and I'm on 28. Gotcha. Okay, in that case we gained flanking range. We gained some, some supply limit. We gained infantry fire. And infantry shock. We did gain a lot. We should be fine. I think we'll be able to beat these armies pretty easily. Okay, let them sample new religions. That seems fine. Uh, we were the defender against Breton Canada and just killed them. Commonwealth is retreating now to here. Or they are retreating to here, rather. Can I not move there? I cannot. We lost the Battle of Liguria. Oh, yikes. Had I tried moving in with, like, no army or something? No river from Parma. Two maneuver versus four maneuver. Yeah, we gotta avoid the river. We have another battle happening somewhere that I just missed. Where was that? Up here. Quick little reinforcement ought to be good, good enough. I'm thinking if I attack this guy, that we will get reinforcements. Or rather, even better, we're in the hills. If you want to come attack me... I would be happy for that, actually. We get a defensive bonus. France France has huge morale. We have a discipline advantage. We have a tactics advantage. We have a slight tech advantage. But they do have more men than we do. We lost that fight. Hmm. Let's grab a leader. They can beat us if we don't use leaders, apparently. Uh-oh, we still can't retreat for two days. Alright, we're gonna retreat. Unfortunately, that battle did not go well. We're still trying to train up some more men. And I've got random ships that are trying to form up. They are heavies, but they're fighting the French light fleet. I wish they would stop trying to do that. Stop trying to rally while we're at war. They should postpone rallying until we're at peace. Okay, that's woods. We're not at full strength, so I'd rather just kill some small armies before we try to go over there. Alright, so we're attacked there, and we're attacked in Barry. Alright, so there is still the one dangerous French stack. Might be too early to be trying to do this sieging. Because they actually are large enough, they can almost stack wipe. Question is, how many of these sieges do we break? I'd say most of them.
Do a little bit more conversion. We throw enough men at the problem. We can still turn the tide. All right, 25 into that. I think we can still win. We've got two tech advantage. We've got a pretty good leader. 3-6 against a 0-0. Zero, zero. Heading to Poito. Hmm. Let's chase after it, see if we can do some damage. I actually kind of want to just end this war, honestly. I don't want to really be at war with France for too long. We've got you at 100%. Aachen, Baden, Swiss, Sweden. That's always a good sign. Because it's a coalition, though. Alright, I actually don't personally have any claims on much, and we don't want to take really any land, do we? Because we're trying to get a, get caught up on, on tech. So what was the purpose of this war? I think it just they joined the coalition, so... No one else has a claim here, a core here. Relationships, 5 out of 6. We could take land from somebody, then create a vassal. Well, only 26% overextension. Why don't we just get rid of this one country? 20% overextension, one province. Let's just do that. I don't want to mess with Sweden. I want to get, get out of some of these wars. Basically just murdered like all of their families. For no real reason. Just because they joined the coalition war. But they were asking for it. Did they join the coalition? I mean, it's their own fault. I shouldn't feel guilty. I don't feel guilty. Alright, we did win that fight, barely. Let's get back to friendly territory so we can recover some of these troops a little bit faster. We want to gain 27,000 manpower, or even more administrative. Well, considering how much manpower we have, I think we'll take the administration. Pretty sizable snack there. 38. Moving into Charolais. Let's go track it down. Supply limit's 51. Kinda close to insufficient support here, very close in fact. Charolais is a good location to fight. We've got a 5-6 leader. Oh, he's actually gonna engage me. Use quick. I wonder if he used forced march there. Six days, can you hold out for six days? Ugh. Fighting without a leader for six days is painful. We lost a lot of men. They lost some artillery, though. Alright, let's track them down. I think they're going to be somewhere down that way. Meanwhile, half their country is going to be occupied soon, so... That will reverse their... their success in this war. Let's see, I attacked USA. That's actually why France is in the war. Interesting.
immediately into combat. This fight should go pretty well then. He's still going to be able to retreat though. He's still going to cause problems with that 21 stack. I've got to just, I've got to chase him. I hate having to chase people around. Meanwhile, these guys desperately need to reinforce. But they keep on getting subjected to battles. All right, Mr. French peoples, stop forming up. Stop making new armies. Just stop it. Cause some problems here. Ooh, look at that terrible, terrible insufficient support. Yikes. Still. No, we cannot afford to, to fight him with this huge amount of insufficient support. Maybe if we were the defender. We got a 6-6 six, six leader, so... No, we need to have a good army. I need some more inventory, shockingly. Let's build a, a new quick template. Uh, we'll just make like 20 infantry. Oh, come on, France. Where'd this 25 stack come from, huh? I see. It's not even really yours. It's the Papal State. How exactly are we at war with the Papal State? Who, who are you allied with? You're allied with France. Okay. And we declared France a co-belligerent. That would explain it. I don't think we're going to make it in time to reinforce that. Nope. But, I've already committed the troops and we're throwing a lot at it. So, looks like Oldenburg's going to contribute a leader. 2-5. Is that Oldenburg? No, that's Aragon. Which means that that army is dead now. Sorry about that, Papal State, but you joined the wrong side. Oh man, I did not actually mean to engage this army right now. Well, we have lots of our cavalry. If I had consolidated the infantry, we'd have an even stronger front line. We have almost no artillery in this army. Yeah, this is a massacre of soldiers. Reinforce. Give me some good troops in the front line. What a miserable fight. It doesn't even matter though, we have so many troops that it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. And we're still sitting at positive stability, so... So we got that going for us, which is nice. The Ottomans have joined a coalition against us. My new infantry stack that needs to come join this army. That's the only thing that it really needs. It's just it needs a lot of infantry to fill in that front row. 
30 cavalry, 22 infantry. Yeah. This army can win, but not convincingly. The reinforcement rate here is only 50%. Which is unfortunate. Um, why is it only 50%? I mean, this is controlled territory. Let's move to our own personal territory. Maybe we can get 100% over there. Despite the fact that it's distant overseas. I mean, France, come on. You've got to give up soon, right? Half the country's sieged. They, I mean, they're not going down with a, without a fight, but they, uh... They are on their last leg, I think. Alright, hey look at that. We actually don't have insufficient support for the moment. Cavalry's army ratio is 59%. It's like barely what we can afford. And now we do. But, we've got massive flanking ability, and we've got cavalry that are really strong. And more importantly, we've got almost every province under siege, so they can't train troops. This has been a messy war with France. Is there anybody that wants out of the war? Nope, not really. Since we have the money and the manpower, I think I'll train up some more infantry templates. Just so we have some more guys. We've got all these heavies now that are actually not rallying. Ottomans have rivaled us now as well, so they're in the coalition and they rivaled us. A little bit of random culture conversion. Now it's at 39, 35, and 12. This is such a massive army. It's not reinforced at all. It's all so weak. I should just consolidate regiments. I don't know why I'm being so stubborn. We can always train more men. It's not like we can't create more. Yeah, this is horrible. Horrible engagement. We still have enough morale. We can control the retreat. We'll let the tick happen. But if we go to combat again with this army, I'm going to consolidate. I'm going to do it. I have to force myself to. Okay, we're going to detach a siege, we're going to select the larger army, we're going to consolidate, we're going to move in. It's just so many people to fight. It's like the last true challenge in the campaign. we stay here, we're only going to reinforce at 50%. If we move to controlled territory, it'll be a little bit better, but we got to move back to our own personal territory if we want maximum. 
On the other hand, we've got 40 infantry already ready. Already ready already. Bring them over. In fact, let's train some more. I'm not going to be able to reinforce that. Okay, I'm going to take a break here. Thanks for watching, everyone. I do look forward to seeing you in the next video, where we will hopefully finish this war with France. And uh, I don't even know what we're going to do with them, really. I just felt like attacking them. Maybe we'll humiliate them. Is there individual war score? 28%? Humiliate. When you're willing to accept a humiliation, I'm willing to let you off the hook. So yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.